Are we the only universe out there? Or is there another version of you out there in space? According to the multiverse theory, there could be other universes besides our own where everything that you do in this life is played out just in an alternate fashion. Each alternate universe carries its own different version of reality. For example, in a different universe, our places will be switched. There will be one where you are narrating this video and I watch it. One where this pandemic doesn't occur but Hitler's Nazi Germany is still ruling the world. Okay, that's stretching the imagination a bit too far but my point is anything is possible in an alternate parallel universe. In today's video, let's try to understand the new theories that attempt to go beyond our understanding of physics. The idea of infinite worlds existed in the ancient Greek philosophy. Atomism, which proposed that infinite parallel worlds arose from collisions of atoms. In 1952, Erwin Schrödinger once gave a lecture in which he warned his audience that what he was about to say might seem lunatic. He said that when his equations seemed to describe several different histories, these were not alternatives but all really happening simultaneously. The concept of multiverse that became popular later on and the one which we'll talk about today is based on Schrodinger's cat, a thought experiment that is sometimes described as a paradox. We know now that our universe is expanding since 13.8 billion years ago after the Big Bang and it will continue to expand forever, which means that space will go on forever. If that is the case, then there's only a finite number of different ways that matter can arrange itself. If you have an infinite expanse with only a finite number of different possibilities, the possibilities have to repeat. When you shuffle a deck of cards, there are only so many different orders that can happen. So if you shuffle that deck again and again, the orders will ultimately have to repeat. Similarly, in the case of an infinite universe, where there are a finite number of different kinds of matter, the way in which matter arranges itself has to repeat. So the collection of matter right now, which makes up both you and me, will repeat itself out there in the cosmos. There are different notions of parallel universes that theoretical physicists have come up with. And among them, the idea of many world interpretation that is based on the field of quantum mechanics is the most intriguing. The rules of the quantum world, which govern the way the world works at the level of atoms and subatomic particles, goes beyond our understanding of reality or our common sense. The quantum rules tells us that a cat can be both alive and dead at the same time, while a particle can be in two places at once. Due to its extreme complexity, it is nearly impossible to talk about quantum mechanics, but let's give it a try. When you make an observation of a quantum mechanical system like an atom or a particle, quantum mechanics doesn't tell you definitively what the answer will be. It tells you the probability of getting one outcome or the other. Back in the late 1950s, a fellow named Hugh Everett came up with the many world interpretation, which says that both of these possible outcomes actually occur. If you observe a subatomic particle here or there, there's a world in which it was there and you saw it there, and another world in which it was over somewhere else and you saw it there. And every time a quantum mechanical interaction takes place, our universe splits into multiple worlds. Therefore, what happens is that there are two universes. In one universe, the particle is here. In the other universe, it's over there. And there's a copy of you in each universe measuring that particle and thinking, incorrectly, that that particle's unique location is the only reality. But in fact, there are two of you thinking that. There are two realities in two parallel universes. When we try to think of it with respect to the position of an electron, it might sound exaggerated and not that relevant to everyday life. After all, who really cares about where one electron is, here or there? 
But then you take into account the fact that everything you think and everything you do, everything you experience amounts to particles moving around inside your body and brain. Every aspect of reality has to do with how particles move. Imagine the multiverse where there could be a multiple universe enclosed in its own bubble, expanding with no knowledge of other bubble universes. These are independent universes from one another and never will they meet or see each other. Just like when you're on a ship at sea and you gaze as far as the eyes can see. That's your universe. The ship on the other end will gaze towards its own horizon but it will not see you. You'll only see each other if somehow the two horizons can overlap. Which means that you'll have to find a way to tunnel from one universe to another in order to access that. But that might lead to some unknown consequences. If the laws of physics which govern you and me in one particular universe won't be similar in a different universe, you'll be ripped apart or cease to exist in a universe where the quantum fluctuations are different than ours. In other words, your whole biochemistry will change. If you guys are new to the channel, then I do encourage you to smash that subscribe button and turn on all notifications to never miss a single video on our channel. As well as giving this video a big thumbs up by slapping that like button below. We make content on a wide range of subjects and you can even suggest us the topics you want us to cover in the comment section below.